Well, here's a, somewhere the cowboy's walking and uh, just going over it uh, to check for anything that needs to be uh, corrected. And uh, this is the color of raw bronze after it's uh, been cast and sandblasted and all that stuff. Looks pretty good. All right, I'm going to go over it and uh, we'll get back to it when we get ready to color it. And then I want this uh, rope here to match the rope coming into his hand, so.
base coat that he's going to put all the color on top of. And uh, he's been at it since 9 o'clock this morning. It's now 1 now 1.32, so it's quite a few hours just getting this far. Don't do anything with the bead work, we'll just leave it white. Those two bead, bead uh, patches on his shoulder. Yeah, I'll have to touch them up a little bit. Yeah, that's fine. But, uh, I don't want them too bright. day two and uh, I don't have a uh, tripod to put this camera on so I'm just gonna have to wing it with my hand he's already got about six hours into this and we probably got another two or three hours left so at least by the way the guy's name is Tanner who's coloring this uh, bronze that's all that. That's, that's just. Well, this is about as far as we got today. Uh, it took a long time to get to this point. Uh, anyway, it'll be picked up again next week when I photograph the piece. He had, I couldn't stay, and uh, so he continued to color the piece, and uh, I'll be going in Monday to photograph it, and uh, hopefully uh, get it out to the client as quickly as possible.